Hi guys, another video review. Uh, I apologize ahead of time for the shadow. Um, because I'm doing this freehand, uh, not on the tripod, because this is, uh, I need to get different angles on this. Um, this is the box. Uh, it comes very much uh, nice and, you know, sleek, kind of um, uh, matte, I think, not like glossy. Um, and it's, you know, it's all sealed up. Um, it is cardboard, obviously. You know, you can see the slats here. Um, I've had this about two weeks, and I still haven't done anything with it. I haven't even opened up these little things. I, I, I open these up to look at them. These are lots of little inserts. There's hearts and little things. And I'll show you where these go in here. And this is more cards and things. And then they give you some tape, which you're definitely probably going to need. And some little flowers and things. So this is very versatile, which is part of the reason why I'm still unsure what I'm going to do with this. Originally I thought, oh, a uh, birthday. And when I got it, I thought, yeah, it, this is like a huge thing. So let me stop talking and show you, right? So this is the this is the original shape of it, right? And this is very easy. I would say a silver pen would go great with this. You know, silver markers, because you could draw all over this. You could do so much with this, that's why I'm kind of overwhelmed. So now I'm thinking maybe Christmas or anniversary. So they open up the first layer. As the name implies, okay, this is a little hard to do with one hand. Uh, it's an explosion box, so boom, la layer one, right? Um, and inside, again, you can put all sorts of stuff in here. You know, if they take it off, you can say, oh, look in the cover, or you can have stuff in there. Um, layer one has your kind of petals, I would call it, like a flower. And these specifically have these little openings here, which is where these come in handy. These are your little inserts. You don't have to use these. But these, I just seen in the pictures, and, I, and, I, and my friend gave me a much simpler version of this than like a photo book. But these can be like, you know, stuck inside here. You can put those little, if you have one of those little uh, Kodak, uh, not Kodak, uh, I don't know what company makes them now, Fuji. It's like the little, it's basically designed like the old Polaroids, but it has like the little 2x4 or 3x2 prints. Those would slip in here. You know, and etc. And then we go in one more. Oop. And then again, you got the flaps. And th these can, you know, you can probably, this is still pretty tight. But you could probably move this more if you want. But I like it a little more firm. And again, there's flaps on these. So you can open these up. And, and they, in, they, they open up where there's, they don't cover up the previous one too much. So you can factor that into your design where you're going to put a picture here. So you want to have it so that, you know, it doesn't get covered also very good and again you can do everything with the covers the other covers um, and that's something in the middle I like as well this one is just flat there's no inserts here because I mean at this point that's a lot of inserts if, you, if you've used all of these and you still need more I think you know that's a lot and these are all doable and this one again one more this one here now what I like about this is this box is the last box right so if I fold these down again so this covers up a little here, but previously it didn't. But they all, again, they still, they kind of, the flaps all go out a certain distance. So if you were really going to be careful, you could have a picture here where, like, the face is still visible. Or you can even have something spell, you know, here. There's a letter here and a letter here. There's a lot of things you could do. Again, silver marker. Definitely. So, now this box I like, because this, this is the absolute center. Right, this video is probably going to be very dark because this is black and with my shadow, so I apologize again. But this is the very center. This box is nice because this box is not connected. So you can take this box out. You can put a ring box in here. This is a really interesting uh, proposal box, you know, because you could have all like your dating things, movie tickets, ticket stubs, flight tickets if it was like international situation. Flight tickets, ticket stubs, restaurant uh match I don't know, they give matchbooks out anymore but like maybe like uh, uh, business cards all sorts of things and then in the middle finally you have this box or you can put it in here because this box again opens up um, the final box opens up and you can probably fit it in here as well but if you had something let me show you the inside you can see that it's just a simple little box but like you, you could put felt in here you could really touch this you could really go crazy with this whole thing you could put felt on the bottom if you're really arts and crafts -y. and I think this holds up pretty well so that this can easily be packed up and kept as a souvenir and brought out again like oh let me show you what, what was given to me etc 
But this last box, you know, you could put something in here, a piece of jewelry or, or anything, really. Like in here, I have the lens cap for the camera. You, know, you can put whatever you want in here. Um, but immediately, I was like, oh, this is, this is like jewelry, prime jewelry. You know, a necklace, a bracelet, or a ring for a wedding or an anniversary or something. But again, this is, this is big enough. I think it would fit in here. But if you wanted to use this separately... That's really fun. Me, I would probably have an IOU letter in here as a joke. and be like, oh yeah, I forgot to put it in there. And then meanwhile, it's in my pocket, right? Because I'm the guy who, who, who gives like a pair of earrings in like seven boxes, each one wrapped with wrapping paper just for a pair of earrings because, you know, it's fun. But yeah, so this is really, really nice. I really like it. Easy five stars. Um, it's $20 at the time I bought this. But for me, like... This is like a gift itself. Like, so you, even if you don't put anything in here, like jewelry or anything expensive, just decorating this and drawing on it and sticking pictures. So like a lot, a lot of stuff, especially now, I'm kind of a middle generation where when I was younger, we had Polaroids. We had, we had to go develop film. So we still have a lot of physical, physical pictures. We still have a lot of physical pictures, right? Uh, and nowadays everything's digital. Everything's digital. And I know a lot of the younger generations, they probably don't care so much about the physical. But if you have somebody who's like me, who grew up with that, and now everything's digital, you print a bunch of pictures, especially now you got Walgreens doing free 8x10s every like month. And like Shutterfly does deals, like 20 cents a print. And there's deals all over the place. So it wouldn't be hard to um, do, do some pictures cut them out do little two by threes and things stick them all over the place and like I said they give you tape so uh, very interesting very versatile and a plus